Hey, how's it going? Welcome back to the channel. Today we have another Billy Beth puzzle. Uh, this is one of the easier ones, I think. Uh, it's called Easiest One, Two, Three, so you'd think it'd be easy, but you never know with the Billy Beth puzzle. Um, let's just jump into the rules here and see what's going on. So it's normal Sudoku. So every row, column, and 3x3 three three box will contain the digits 1 through 9 once each. Digits on purple lines are consecutive and non-repeating, but in any order. So those are Renban lines. So these four digits will be some set of consecutive non-repeating digits. Then we have killer cages. So digits and cages add to the sum in the corner and are non-repeating. Looks like we've got a bunch of sixes. So all of these cages will add to six. And there it is. Easy as can be, right? Well, let's dive into it and see if we can figure that out. Links in the description below. Let's get started. Let's have a little bit of fun. So the... Uh, the big elephant in the room is these are all one, two, threes. So let's start thinking about what goes on with that. Well, this is a one, two, three. This has to be a four. Now this has a two on it, so this doesn't. These are a one, two, three. Don't quite know what these are. Okay, we do know what this goes on here though. If this was a one or a two, we're going to break this. So this has to be the three. And then it has to go upwards. So it oh, didn't mean to have you on. So that's a four or five pair. You can go away. This is a three. Now we know this is a one, two pair. So this is a three, four. That's the four. That's the three. That's the one, two, three. You guys are not threes anymore. One of you two is. You're not a three anymore. And actually the one, two just says this one is three. <clears throat> Perfect. All right. Now. This guy here says that's the three, so you're the two and you're the one. Two, one, two, one. And are we now to the point where we can start uh, looking elsewhere? Let's start with some Sudoku <clears throat> and see where that takes us. Then we'll jump into all these Ren bands and see if we can pick those apart. Uh, not much there now on the two, or the ones, excuse me. Yeah, not seeing a ton on the twos either. We know one of those two. We know one of these guys. And it can't be you, because this already has a three on it, so you are the three. I think that should do it. Yeah, we have that X-Wing on threes left. Let's see if there's anything on the four here first, and then we'll move on. Actually... I could have done more with this guy, can't I? Because this cannot be a one-two pair. Well, it can't be ones, it can't have a one on it, period, is what I'm trying to say, because it would have to be uh, either a one-three, which makes this a two, and then how do you bridge that gap, or a one-two, and this is a three, what do you put here? So this is the one, two, three. That's going to give us two, three, one and one and two. Now we have everything uh, lined up to go. Let's see the ones, twos, threes, and maybe fours, see if we have anything left we can do with them. We can. Just wanna make sure I'm looking at that correctly. Yes, this is a one, so this is a two. No, 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 and no, so that's the last one. One, two, three, one, two, three, one, two, three. Yep, this is the two to go on that Ren ban. And Oh, looks like we're done with the twos as well. Three should be done. They are. Let's try our fours, and then we'll go from there. Good. We know there's a four on this thing, so it's going to be a four, five, six, because it can't have one, two, or three. This is not the four. These have to be sevens, eights, and nines. And, well, this could be six, seven, eight or nine. We don't necessarily know what's going on there. Now, we can go on to this Ren band though. <clears throat> this has a three on it. It can't have a one or a two go with it, so it has to be a three, four, five, and the four has to go over here. That's going to tell us this is the five, that's the six, and now this is a seven, eight, nine triple. Good. Now, what else do we see here? The two, three says you are a four, so you are the five, four. Do we have any of these other guys that are given or we just need to look them up? 
think. Well, let's start right here and see how this works out. Yeah, we could also kind of look here, but I'm going to start here first because just what I saw first, that's what I'm going to give it a go. So we're looking at five, seven, eight, and nine. Now, is there any real restriction there? I don't think there actually is. Yeah, I don't see anything correlating with it. I mean, this one can't be a five, but it doesn't, still doesn't really tell us what this could be. Okay. Uh, do we think about this guy? Because we, we know we have one, two, three, and four already taken, so these are going to be from five, six, sevens, eights, and nines. We don't know if it's five, six, seven, eight, or six, seven, eight, or nine. We know there's no five here, though. This is going to be the other digit, whatever isn't used. And we know this will have six, seven, and eight on it. So this has to be a five or a nine. It can't be a five because we can't connect it here. So this is our nine. So we know what these are. This is the five. This has to be an eight. Let's get rid of those. Um, why did I push? I meant to get those. Okay. For some reason I thought it did something weird there. Oh, this couldn't have been the four or five. That's what what it was. I think I pushed a five and I was like, why didn't it why did it do what it did? Um anyway. One of these two will be a five. I don't know if we can say what those are, but what are you? You're nine. So you're not. So this guy has a nine on it, so you don't. And we know these two are gonna be the same digit, but I don't really think that tells us too much. Let's maybe jump over to here. Because we still need to have six sevens and eights. We also need these to be six sevens and eights. Trying to see if we can find something that's going to give us a good clue as to what's going on here. Six, five, seven, nine, eight, seven, six. Mm, there's quite a bit, I think, that could still go into some of these, so I don't know that this is the greatest place. You're not an 8, by the way. What are you guys? 5, 6, 7. Okay. Well, that doesn't rule this out as being... Well, this could be the last 5, 6, 7 to make that trip, or there could be a 4 on here. We know one of these two is a 4. Does that help us in any? We know one of these is a four. Doesn't really help us here. Let's let's put these guys in. Five, six, sevens, and eights. We probably just need to figure out one of these other guys to get going here, but it's trying to find something on the loose without having to dig into all of the numbers. Don't know if I see something that's guarantee here okay yeah we do this can't be a four because it would force this to be a five and that would break this so you go away so there is a four on this thing which means it's four five six because it can't go down if that's four five six these are not fives or sixes that is a seven eight this has to be the nine which means this is a 7, 8 there. This becomes the 6. That's what I was looking for. This is either 5 or 7. In fact, these are 5, 7, and 8. Let's put those in. Now, there can never be a, a 5 on this guy because we couldn't make any of this work. This becomes our computer. This becomes... Wow, this thing will not react to me. These guys have to be, that has to be a nine. These are not, that seven, eight says that's a five. These two have to be six and nine. Uh, can we figure that out by this? Not really. Well, yes, we can actually. No, but we can get, we can't determine exactly what this is, but we can get ourselves a pair and then we can probably figure out some more stuff here. So, this being a 6 can't go down to a 5, so it would have to be a 7. If it's a 9, it has to be an 8. That gives us the 7-8 pair. This has to be a 4-5-6 grouping. You are not a 5. Does that 
tell us what's going on here? Because we don't necessarily know if there is a four on this or not. Hmm, looks like there could be. Now, well, I guess we probably have to put a four on there, right? Yeah. If we don't put a four on this guy, what goes on here? Because we would have a five, six pair right here. So we could put a seven with it, but then you have to put a four, eight, nine up here. So this has the four on it, which means this is four, five, six. This is seven, eight, nine. Now, one of those two has to be a five then. So this is the seven. That then removes these from having sevens. You don't have a seven. So you are a five, six. You can't go to seven. You have to be a four. You're not fours. You are this is going to break stuff open. Good. You can't be four or five, so you're six, five, four. And then you have to be seven, eight, or nine. Is there something? Yeah, there's a six on here, so we know it's going to be six, seven, eight, nine. We know one of these will be the nine. Four, five. I guess we don't technically know what these guys do yet, do we? Because this will have a six and a nine on it. But that just means that the other one is one of the seven eights, and this is the last seven eight. So let's see if we can find. Yeah, we can. Five, six here says seven. I was going to see if there's anything else we could find that can get us through this. The six says eight, six. That says nine. That is going to work through all this perfectly. Because now these can't be the nines. This is. Good. That means this is the six. So this is the seven. This is the eight and the seven. These are not sevens. This is and eight. Perfect. What are you now? You are the nine. This five says this is the six and the five. You're not the nine. So you are. And you are just a given now. which should sort out this bad boy. Or maybe it won't. But that's a six. This is the nine. We could have gotten that in multiple ways. One, two, five. This is five, seven, or eight. It's not five. So this is our five. This has to be a seven, eight, seven. This is the eight. And the eight here, we can't repeat. So this is the seven and the eight, eight and seven. And eight and six. Perfect. You saw the puzzle. So just that is by far the easiest Billy Beth puzzle I have tried. And I've tried a lot of them. Um, so get your easy puzzle in right there if you haven't already. Uh, a thousand solves in 17 days. Yes, it was a good puzzle. You can very easily logic your way through it and get it done. That was easy as one, two, three. Love that puzzle. Um, still trying to get more of their more difficult puzzles done because some of them are quite difficult. And I think some of them just have a lot of little tricks that if you don't know, you're not going to figure them out. And I haven't been able to figure out what those tricks are for some of them yet. So working on it. <laughs> anyway, hope you all enjoyed that nice little puzzle there. And uh, we'll see you next time. Thanks a lot.